Welcome to the best dividend stocks 2022 and 23. Let's go. We have Altria Group, Philips, and Petrobras. This one is Altria Group, yearly chart, amazing uptrend. Yeah, we have here more than 50 years of uptrend, guys. One candle represents one year, and we have more than 700,000% of performance. You know, we are including dividends as well. Obviously, if we deactivate this, we will see like way more or less. Uh, performance yeah. but that's normal yeah the, the exact percentage without dividends would be um let me see it yeah say seventy thousand. yeah so it's, it's, well it's not the same you know we are talking about a huge difference this is why dividend stocks are very popular and if you're watching this video you know it because the percentage that you can gain uh comparing with other stocks that don't have dividend is completely huge because if, the, if it go up and the dividend goes on growing you get this kind of results it's incredible because right now we have our dividend on eight eight percent so imagine guys those who started buying the stock at the beginning you know in the 80s and the, you know holding the stock they increase the dividend over time so in the end that's the that's how they got like more than seven hundred thousand percent, you know, because they increase the dividend, they hold the stock for a long period of time, and again and again and again, the performance is 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 going nuts, you know. To the next one, Enrique, we have Philips, which is quite the opposite, you know, because this is a completely different stock, you know. Uh, yeah. Look, look at that. Well, this is completely different. Let's go to the daily chart, you know, so we can clear we can clearly see better. What's yeah, the, what this downtrend movement, it has been very very pronounced. I think that. This doesn't reflect like the the situation of the company. Yeah, in the end, the company in, in last year it had like the best benefits you know ever. You know, I, we're talking about a net income of more than three billion, so a um, profit margin of nine nineteen percent. Yeah, almost twenty percent. It was the record. It was the best year ever. Obviously, if that were affecting the price, but then you know a, a correction of more than how how much are we talking about sixty seven percent. That's insane, you know. I mean, uh, right now yeah. we have a dividend right of six percent. So remember, guys, that when you are investing in a in a stock, in a dividend stock, as long as the company is, is good, you know, in what they do, it, it uh, is they ha if they have a good catalog of products, which is, is the case, you know, at Philips they have uh, the light bulbs, they have a lot of things, you know, um, for the electronic appliances. So they have a great portfolio of products. Um. So right now, this move, this bearish move, um, it has a reason, you know, because they there was, like, you know, in 2022, a lot of companies are making less money than in 2021. But this is exaggerating, you know. If, if this was a United an American company, it wouldn't have happened. Yeah, I think that this market, as usual, is is different. Uh, they don't have the same exposure. So investors uh, don't have like that idea, you know, maybe big investors are entering Philips, but not the general market, the retail market. Mm -hmm. So as soon as they see that opportunity more clear and the big investors have accumulated around these levels, we could see the price skyrocketing again because we are talking about an upside potential just to the previous highs of uh, 250% plus the dividend that is 6% right now almost. So I think this is also a very good opportunity. Let us know in the comments also what do you think. Exactly. And remember, guys, if uh, the company, if the stock price goes a little bit lower, doesn't matter. You add more positions. Multiple entries is the best strategy you can get, even in dividends. It, it really works. So be patient with this one. Uh, you can add positions over time. Uh, obviously, we are in the middle of a downtrend, so maybe it's not the best area to buy. But sometimes buying the dip at these prices it's a good strategy, as long as the company is good, you know? Yes, as, as usual, we always recommend risk management and you could try uh, for a <laughs> breakout to happen or your own trading plan. But the key here is to diversify and manage that risk. Okay, let's finish with Petrobras, another one of, our, you know, one of our favorites, actually. Yeah. So the dividend is insane. I, I don't know if, if this is correct or not, because 65% of dividend yield, if that's correct, this is insane. But there are a lot of risks here in Bolofad as well, Enrique. Tell us. Yeah, the thing with this dividend is that it, <laughs> it changes a lot. You know, sometimes they pay like uh, 002 per share, sometimes even 2.5. That's a lot. That's why the percentage changes, you know, it varies depending on the website that you check it out or, or where are you looking for it. But this one is not as the others because um, we can clearly see in the weekly chart 
that it has a huge uptrend but then a huge correction to the same exact level and then the price is like ranging it seems like it's going up again but you know you have huge corrections in the price uh, as soon as something happens in this market so if you invest in the long term here take into account that you should add some positions in the lower part of the chart because it bounces from there but also it has some tops not financial advice but here you should more like swing trade it yeah, exactly. Even though it's a it's a dividend stock, <clears throat> you can hold it for a, for a period of time, but not forever. You know, look at look at these triangles. Look at the channels that we have here. These breakouts. This is insane. You know, I mean, it's 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 perfect technical analysis. So yeah, you can follow this, but as soon as you see a breakout on you know, in one of these sides, you know, if you see a breakout on the downside, sell it because look at what happens when you don't do it. Yeah, minus seventy percent, and also then the huge opportunity to buy you know the best one as usual when everyone is getting out of the market and no one wants to buy it uh, you have the opportunity of earning 500 percent and then in the last one we're talking about yeah the same 500 something percent so right now we are near the top so maybe it's not the best moment to start buying but if you have like a plan of multiple entries and you buy at different levels you shouldn't worry about the actual, the factual price, you know, it's like the dividend will compensate that losses. And then in the long term, you are buying lower and lower and lower. And you believe the company will recover. You will mm -hmm. get much better prices to enter. I wouldn't say don't buy it, uh, but I would say, <clears throat> no financial advice, of course, that you can buy it and hold it, you know, for now. But be careful, be careful and follow these uptrends, mm -hmm. you know, because if you see a breakout below $10, uh, I would exit, you know. I would exit without, without hesitation, uh, but also have in mind that this is emerging markets. This is a, a company from Brazil, and they are thinking about uh, all Latin Latin countries, Latin American countries, yeah. to create a new um, a new currency together. So if that happens, maybe that would strengthen uh, strengthen the the all these companies, you know, because the confidence in the, of investors will will increase. If that happens, this stock could skyrocket. That yeah, they, maybe they compensate and we are all, all, obviously we are just stating our opinion and the thing here I think is diversify with dividends. The more that they do, the stocks you have in your portfolio, I think the better because in the long term, maybe some companies will crash, others will skyrocket and in the end, if you are diversificate, diversificating your capital, you will get that results that you're looking for. So guys, video on the right, keep watching us, human traders. Thank you, we love you, subscribe and welcome.